What's up, timekeepers? Me, Tom Graham here. We're going to be starting Portal 2 for you guys. So, if you're ready, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. Alright guys, so today I finally decided to start Portal 2. I played the last one, it's four videos long, so if you guys want to go check that out, it's full playthrough. Uh, I'm going to be doing the same with this, I'm going to be playing the full playthrough. I've never played Portal 2, never had when I played Portal 1, so... And we'll go from there, so I'm assuming cause it's a lot of the same thing, the Portal gun and all that thing. Hopefully my sound's not glitchy. Hopefully it fixes after a while, but we'll see. So without further ado, let's just jump into Portal 2, so let's go. Alright, so you guys, if you don't remember what Portal 1 was, is basically you're in the 19 test chamber, and the last one you actually have to escape from it, and then you defeat Gladius, Gladios, I don't remember exactly the name, sorry. Of course, you find out the kick your promise is a lie, the most famous line from that game, or the series, pretty much, I would say. Uh, I don't, so I don't know what this one's about, I think you're playing robots, I think. We'll see, I'm sorry, I'm not, I've never, I, I wasn't, uh, uh introduced to uh, portal at a young age uh portal for like computer games were a bit uh i was more of a console player i'm still am but so i right uh, right now decide to play the classic so we'll see from here what happens good morning you have been in suspension for 50 days in compliance with state and federal regulations all testing candidates in the aperture science extended relaxation center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise all right. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. This completes the gymnastic <laughs> section of your mandatory <laughs> gymnastic. physical and mental wellness exercise. Framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. Okay. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Mm -hmm. Nice piece of art. You should now feel mentally reinforced. Okay. <laughs> if you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Good. Now please return to your bed. Sleep. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for the whistling. That probably hurt a bit of ear, ear ray, a ear, uh, yeah, ear pains. You have been in suspension for Hello? Anyone in there? The Hello? Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. You look um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. Yeah, Plenty yeah. Of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm. Stay, stay oh, calm. Oh, oh. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh. uh am I getting crushed here or. You all right down there? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I don't know what the fuck's going on. subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration okay. after a few months in suspension now you've been under for quite a lot longer and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage oh don't be alarmed all right uh, although if you do if you do feel alarmed try to hold on to that feeling because <laughs> that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage mm -hmm. do you understand what i'm saying at all does anyone yes yeah, yes sense? yes yes just tell me just say yes Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Oh God. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Oh dear okay, God. You know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh no, not a meltdown. Jesus Christ. Okay, look, I wasn't gonna mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? Not good. Mm hmm Hold on, this is a bit tricky. All right. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, what should tell Oh dear God, no. Oh dear God, no. Why should I be kept informed? You know about the life functions of the ten thousand bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Am I gonna make it through? But on a 
E... Oh, dear God. Oh, that's not it. Yeah, that's really not good, actually. Oh, my God. Okay. Right. Oh, sure. Sure. Okay. Almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. Okay. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Oh, dear God. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Oh, Jesus. Manual override on the wall. <laughs> Smashing it to the wall. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh, jeez. You are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet, but um, all right. at least you're a good jumper. So you got that, you got the jumping on all the right. side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Uh, am, I, am I going in? All right, off you go. What happens if I wait? But if, if I don't want to go? Go on, just march on through that hole. Over here? I... I are you sure? Are you sure? Are we really sure? I know, I know. I have painted quite a grim picture. On yeah, you, you have. But if you simply stand here, we will both surely die. All right, that makes a good point, I guess. So once again, just move along. One small step and everything. Oh. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science. Embrace. God damn it. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will right. open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Oh, it's me again. All right. Okay. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science. We're going to go through this again. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, we don't worry. Jesus Christ. Are very slim. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. Okay, the elevator looks different. Holy shit. Aperture laboratory. It's really not good. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes. Oh, that's not... that's... A lot more foresty than I remember remember this place to be. Alrighty. Okay. Where's the damn button again? There it is. Let's go. All right. Let's keep going here. 
Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Oh shit. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. <laughs> an Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. All right. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Oh, that that's not good. All right, let's keep going, Dan. All right, test chamber two. I think I remember this. Hey, hey, you oh, made it. Jesus Christ! There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it though. Maybe it fell off. Do you want to go and have a quick look? Oh, it did. Oh shit! Ah, uh, thank God that was water. Can you see the portal gun? Also, are you alive? If that's important, you should have asked that first. <laughs> uh, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go team! Oh, there's the portal gun. All right. All right. Uh, I think it's broken. All right. Great, I just have the blue portal again. Brings back memories. At least I don't have to go through that course still. Oh, at least it tells me where the portals are too. That's cool. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest Shit. assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. All right. Hmm. This is some jid, this is some fuckery right here. Oh no, there's no fuckery. Can I do the whole camera falling thing? Yes. Yes, I can. But if you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Alright, that's, uh, that's okay. Okay, we got half of the portal gun right now. Doesn't seem broken, so that's good. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Ah. All right, that was easy. Okay. Oh. I think I remember this one. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. What is this? Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, of course. God damn it. Gosh darn it. Oh, we got a side road, okay. 
There we go. There we go. Unreason. Okay, that's not good. Hmm. Alright. Guess so far the test is going good. Alright guys, I'm going to leave the first part of Portal 2 here. If you go, of course like the video, please subscribe and like the video. We really appreciate that. You can also follow me everywhere, Me Time Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and of course, right here, youtube.com forward slash Me Time Gamer, where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Of course, leave a comment below uh, any t tricks or trips for Portal 2. Of course, don't spoil the ending because I'm not, not going to read it. But of course, uh, uh, yeah, leave a comment below if you got any tips and tricks and any other games you want me to try. Of course, always leave it, leave it in the comment below. Really, really appreciate that. Uh, I'm always trying to find new games to play and or small little games. So yeah. So thank you so much guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Keep on keeping on.